Hi, welcome to my YouTube channel Clickview Enthusiast. I'm Abhishek, a Clickview learner, and in this video I will talk about the partial reload. So, like a reload that will load the entire data into the system, partial reload is a feature where it will not look up on the data that you have already loaded or it will not gonna reload the data which you have already loaded but it will either add the new data to your existing data set or it will replace your existing data set with a new data set so generally we encounter uh, these two kind of situations for our dashboards and uh, reports where uh, we just either we just want to add the data to our da to our dashboards and reports or we want to refresh our data with the new data uh, by replacing the existing data with the new data that two scenarios are fulfilled with the help of the partial reload feature of the click view so let's see how we can do it and before we will add uh, the scripting and everything let's see the existing data so currently we have this 2011 year and 2012 data so first thing that we will do is we will add the 2013 data uh, without reloading the existing data which is 2011 and 2012 so for that we will move into the edit script this is the script which is loading the 2011 and 2012 data right and below to this we will put our cursor here and we will click on table files we will click on 2013 data which we need to add and we click finish and here we will remove this directory and semicolon and we will just put a keyword add this add keyword is the key over here so I will tell you where from where we need to do the partial reload because this reload button will reload all the data this data and the uh, data below to it but that's not what we want we need the partial reload it means only this script to run where we have the new data so for that we will click save and ok so I'm again saying not do not hit the load reload button just save it and press ok and go to the file and here is the option for doing the partial reload so it will only go to that new script which we have uh, after the add keyword so we'll click here partial reload and now you will see our new data is here so in this way uh, our earlier file or the earlier script was not ran and uh, not run and only this 2013 data related script was run and data is added here now the another thing which I told you was replacing the data so suppose you want to replace the 2011 and 2012 data with the 2013 data if that is your requirement then you will need to go into edit script and instead of add you will say replace replace but again you will not hit reload you will just save and click OK and you will go to file and you will hit on the partial reload so now you see all of your 2011 and 2012 data has gone and you just have the 2013 data so that's what the feature is uh, the partial reload where either you can add to your existing data but the only good thing is that it will not use your system resources in loading the already loaded data which was for 2011 and 2012 in this case and it will just load or add the 2013 data if you are using the add keyword in the script but on the other hand if you just want that you to remove the 2011 and 12 data and insert this new 2013 data then you will use this keyword replace and it will do the magic for you so that's pretty much all I wanted to discuss in this partial reload a video I will meet you in the new video with a new topic till then bye bye